Hey, what's up guys, your boy Urock Alex here, and today I'm going to be explaining the fastest way to rank up in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. So here you guys can see I'm level 32, um, so I've been playing a little bit. Uh, I actually like ranked up two prestiges in like the first week, and then I stopped playing a little bit because like from playing it so much I got sort of bored, so I had to change up games a little bit. Um, but anyways... The, these are the fastest ways I've found to rank up and like what problems I ran into So I'm gonna be explaining you guys how to rank up fast and how to avoid those problems that stop you from ranking up And I've broken it down into four easy simple steps so First step don't worry about your KD Seriously, if you want to rank up do not worry about your KD now I'm gonna be explaining the, the best game mode and like third step or something But I'm gonna be explaining it right now your KD, um, well, I'm just playing part of it. Your KD, you have to like go around the map and kill people like from behind. You're not really playing the object objective because if you play the objective, you're you're gonna get killed a lot. For example, momentum and hardpoint are the best um, game modes I've found. And if you like um, don't play the objective, you only get 50 kills per kill or 50 points per kill. But if you play the objective. You go and capture that flag, you get 125 points, or you go and capture the, or go um, secure the hard point, you get 125 points. And while you're in there, you get 125 points for every kill. Um, so I, I think that's uh, really good. You have to play the objective. Don't worry about your KD because that's just going to slow you down and not rank you up. As you can see here, uh, my KD is 0.99. <sighs> just got to get like. 20 kills and it's 1.0 but yeah okay second thing is play with a good class okay again the you have to use the best class you're at okay don't worry about ranking up those guns or getting those cool camos um uh yeah don't worry about getting those camos or unlocking those attachments or whatever um what you want to be worrying about is using your best gun because with your best gun you can get the most kills the fastest and for me it's the battle 27 right now but i also recommend the imr those are the two best guns i found so you want to be using those or your best gun um so for me the battle 27 and i get a lot of kills with those um with that and also make sure if you're playing momentum or hardpoint or some one of those like objective game modes Use Semtexes. Seriously, those get you a ton of XP, and I'll be explaining that in a second. Okay, so third thing, play the right game mode. So I recommend Momentum and Hardpoint. Those are the best I've found. Um, the zeroth, zeroth prestige, like before prestige, and on my first prestige, I use Hardpoint all the time. Now I use Momentum because I find it faster and easier. Mostly because, since you guys see, I have two Semtexes, Semtexes, yeah, I have two of them, so, and Momentum, it's a small area, Hardpoint is a bigger area, so Momentum, if there's like a couple people capturing Hardpoint, I throw both of my grenades in there, and I usually get like at least a double kill or a triple kill or something, because there's always like a bunch of people in the Hardpoint, or in the Momentum, which is like captured a flag a little bit, but a little bit different, but anyways, you get a lot of points from that like from a kill getting a kill from someone capturing it you get 125 points so if you get a double kill or a triple kill that means you get like two, excuse me 250 or 375 ish and that's why i recommend some texts so much for these two game modes and game modes with like objectives like i don't know domination or something but these two recommended the most if you want to rank up these two are the best Momentum, I found it. I found it better than Hardpoint. A lot of people are saying Hardpoint is really good, also. So whatever you guys find works better for you, use that one. And then fourth thing and last thing is your challenges. Actually, we're, we have five challenges and uh, armory, but I'm sort of condensing them into one. But anyways, your challenges. Do your challenges, but. 
listen up. Don't try to do your challenges where you get killed a lot. Or don't like strive for your challenges so much where you get like massacred by everyone. Um, I think that's pretty cool. But yeah, don't do that. You're gonna freaking not get no points or anything. You're just gonna die. So for example, I forgot which one it was like here. This one to jump. I was like jumping like a whole game, like just jumping. Well, I was still killing people and stuff and doing the objective, but I kept on jumping and they just kept on killing me. I went like 0.2 KD on that match, which, which I said not to worry about your KD, but um, I got like only like two kills and I died like what, like 20 times or something. I forgot or whatever. I forgot the calculations, whatever. I just died like 20 times and got like two kills and it was really bad. So don't do your challenges that are like really hard. Just like don't really worry about your challenges. Just if it's like some easy one or something or if it's like a, a cool one you want, then I guess do it, but don't try so hard where you get killed so much. Um, and yeah, and then your armory. This is the last step to ranking up fast. So I just, <laughs> I just made a video exactly like this but i messed up a little bit so i had to re-record it so i sold something in that and i don't know if i have something else to sell but selling your items gives you a lot of xp for example here you get a thousand and like for leads you get two thousand thousand and actually your inventory can get uh, filled up so you have to uh, sell these things or else um you'll get filled up with stuff so you guys can see here i don't know what to sell actually for you guys i like all my stuff i like sold everything i don't like hmm. crap i don't want to sell it the well this one's not well i think this is hard well anyways you just press x and then it says you can sell it so yeah that's pretty easy I'll have two of these. Okay, I'll sell this one. There you go. You get 500 XP for that. So, there you guys saw that you get XP from selling stuff. And that actually helps out a little bit. Especially when your inventory is like full. And you gotta sell stuff. Um, that can get you some XP. And, yeah guys. That's pretty much all. So, drop a like if you found it helpful. Or, if this like helped you rank up faster. And you found it helpful for you ranking up faster um oh also um one last thing for your kd i guess worry about it a little bit i mean i don't want you guys going like 0.2 kd or anything just try to keep it positive but like play the objective also like don't worry too much about it just try to keep it a little bit positive but yeah okay so drop a like if you found it helpful or if it helped you out getting rank up faster and um Subscribe if you guys want to see more Advanced Warfare. I'm going to be uploading like a bunch um, this weekend or this week because I'm thinking break off the whole week off. And I'm going to be uploading like every single day. I'll try to. Um, but make sure you comment below what you guys want because I don't know what you guys want. I don't know what videos you guys want. I'll just have to like come up with something cool and hopefully you guys like it. But if you comment down below, I know what you guys want so I can upload stuff you guys want to see or whatever. So yeah guys, um, drop a like, subscribe if you want to see more, and share if you really really liked it and you want like your friends to see it, which I don't know why you would want them to see it, because, <laughs> well, for me, I want to be higher than my friends, so I usually don't show my friends and stuff how to rank up that. But like maybe you're a good friend <laughs> and you want to show your friend how to rank up faster share it and yeah like share subscribe comment yo guys one last thing uh, i'm gonna be uploading soon a guide to uh, get high kill streaks really high kill streaks uh to get like like dna bombs if you're like not a good player not very good if you usually like go negative or like barely positive and you want to go like super positive like getting like 15 kills or 20 kills without dying or even more if you're like really really good um 
well not really good really really good but like you can like get like all kill streaks like I get like paladins like every single match um I'll click the annotation on the screen and if it's not there yet then that means I still have to upload it so if, if you would like to see it click that subscribe button so you'll <clears throat> be notified when I upload it so yeah guys that's all peace out subscribe peace